Hi guys, thanks for tuning into this Scan Tool Network video. In this video, we're going to show you um, the iCarsoft BMM version 2.0 kit. We're in a BMW 3 Series, which has the airbag um, driver restraint system message on screen here. So we're going to show you how to diagnose and reset this warning message and light with the BMM version 2.0. This kit is available by clicking the link directly below this video. It will take you to a genuine listing. Unfortunately, click, uh, clones and uh, fakes do exist, so uh, make sure you follow the link in the description and that will take you to the genuine product. Uh, we'd hate for you to get your hands on one of these fakes because they're no good, they don't do as they are supposed to. So we're gonna click on to diagnostics here. Um, click on to diagnostics and click on to BMW. We've got this plugged into the diagnostic port and we're going to go through and select the airbag system. So just follow exactly as I'm doing and we go to scroll down. You can see it's got 103 potential systems that this tool can connect to. Um, on this one, this is what we want the SRS supplemental inflatable restraint system. So we'll click OK to that. Click on fault code. And it's giving us three fault codes. This is one of three. Um, you, in all cases, you'll get a, a unique fault code, so uh, numbers, sometimes letters, and below that, you will get a description of the fault. Now, if you're not entirely sure what any of this means, don't worry about it too much because my advice would be to put all of these uh, codes into a Google search engine and it will throw back lots of results because other people will have had this fault and I'll show you how they have fixed this particular problem with these particular uh, fault codes. So uh, don't worry about that too much, the answers will be on Google. Uh, but I'll show you what we've got in any case. So we've got belt tensioner, that's the first one, that's the second one. And that's the third one. What caused this fault? Well, we found a loose connection underneath the driver's seat. Uh, so to get rid of this, <clears throat> and in your case, maybe if you've got a loose connection or you need to replace a sensor somewhere along the line, uh, once you've fixed the fault or if it's an intermittent fault or you've, you've just simply knocked the airbag light on by accident, uh, just go to clear fault memory and click OK when I do, well, OK or enter will do. When I do this, just keep one eye on the airbag light and the message there. There we go, they have both reset now. We've got a raise operation done on screen and it's all thanks to the iCarsoft BMM version 2.0. It covers all systems within your BMW or Mini. Uh, it has also a wide range of special functions as well, service functions as you can see here. Uh, so it's a really, really impressive tool by iCarsoft. But as I say, use the link in the description below this video because that will take you to the genuine product. I'd hate for somebody to get their hands on one of these fake or clone tools uh, because they are destroying the industry. Anyway, enough on that. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.